Well, the Texas legislature wants to make it easier for law enforcement officers to seize the vehicles of people who are caught street racing or stunt driving. Hannah is live with the story. Tim, good morning. Recently, we've heard a lot more about street racing and street stunting in North Texas, and for good reason. In Dallas, complaints about street racing doubled from 2019 to 2020. Well, now street racers could lose their cars. State Senate passed a bill last night that makes it easier for law enforcement to seize a vehicle involving street racing if the driver causes a death, if the driver is under the influence of alcohol or drugs, or if the driver has multiple racing offenses. Dallas and other major cities lobbied lawmakers to get this bill passed. It's already passed in the House, and Governor Abbott is expected to sign it. We have had some discussion on this floor about racing and street exhibitions and the dangers that they are presenting and how popular they have become in our, um, in our state, leading to um, a lot of problems for the police and um, death in our communities. State Representative John Turner of Dallas authored this bill and State Senator Joan Huffman of Houston sponsored it in the Senate. If signed by Governor Greg Abbott, the bill becomes effective September 1st. For Good Day, I'm Hannah Batom.